a message from the two of the boys when that there's been an awful there's been a there's been an actual tragedy, a total mistake. Like and and I saw it and I was like, ah oh, that's <laughs> what I'm <laughs> And we're trying whiskey today. A very exciting whiskey! So this is a really exciting whiskey. We've been waiting for this one for a while. So this one, it's exciting and it's also extra extras. Oh yeah. It's extra it's extras. It's right on brand. So this is, you may or may not have heard of Duncan Taylor. So they're an independent bottling company based in Glasgow. They've been going since like 1930 something. And oh, they're based really? in... I didn't yeah. they were that old. Oh, that's really cool. And based in Huntley now. So they have got a range of Octave whiskies. Uh, so Octave being a much smaller cask. So your average casks are two, two, five hundred litres. Mm -hmm. This one's just 50 litres that they use for this. So it's been... In a uh, eight or ten years and finished for ten months in a ex space aid. No, sorry, sherry. <laughs> ex <laughs> sherry, space aid. An ex <laughs> uh, sherry cast. But they don't tell us what type of sherry cast. So I presume it'll be like uh, Oloroso or something like that. Usually I find, I mean, usually go with Oloroso if they don't it's specify. The default, so yeah. it's the default, yeah. So uh, smaller cast means more wood contact, which means more maturation in a quicker amount of time in CD. Yeah, I always think like more like. Okay, so you in your face flavour and less, maybe not as much depth of flavour. Definitely, definitely. Often um, more like spicy, lively. I found this with a bracla actually because I'd bought a bracla from this and it was mm -hmm. really delicious but it was very sweet up front yeah, for sure. Yeah. Um, so Glen Alkey is also a very in vogue distillery at the moment so it's fun to try some Glen Alkey. I'm probably more of a Glen Alkey like, fan than yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah. Because I'm all about the style. shared space sides right now. But this whiskey, I said it was extra extra, sorry I'm very spilly. Um, I said it was extra extra us so you may or may not be able to see this or you may or may not know I can the spelling it, I can. so or you could put you can put a picture I can of it put as a well picture of it if we need yeah so uh, we have a shop called Calendar Drinks Company and we're infamous for spelling mistakes and we are every single presentation we do every single Facebook post every yep. single Everything. Product on our website has, has spelling a, mistakes. A, a typo. So this one, true to form, also does. So it's spelled C A L L A N D A R rather than E R. Calendar, calendar. And it got all the way through all the all, all the different the checks, people tasks. The... <laughs> it wasn't us for once. We didn't for actually do the proof. Us, so we're not it, blaming if anyone it at had all. Had been, we still would. We probably would have absolutely it something entirely different. And to be honest, I wouldn't want it any other way. No, no, I like it. I like it. It's just us. It's very on brand for us. <laughs> so very exciting. <laughs> I've never tried an independent bottle of Glen Alkey. Neither have I. No, so, apparently they're doing quite a lot of it now, so there might be more more about. And it will usually only taste, or I've only tasted it as a mega sherry bottle. Mm. Yeah, than a, yeah, same. Oh, um, that's different. They've got taste notes as well. Do you want to hear theirs? Uh, well, I, well we do could do to, ours first before. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. I it's, think that's quite fresh. Definitely much fresher than your average Glen Alkey, which obviously would think it's the cask. So what I want to see. Are we? 55.3. I want to say sand and I don't know why. I get what you mean. It's got like a kind of... Yeah. It's not salty oh, like seashore like or anything, but it's like kind of sandy. There's like... something like a varnishy smell, but a lovely varnish smell. Yeah. And sand, I can kind of get like in a... War... It's like on a warm beach. Uh-huh. Yeah, oh, tr it's tropical. Is that... A it's maybe got kind of coconutty. Like almost a tropical for me, but not quite getting there. It's oh, quite it's floral great. as well, actually. And there's a wee... there's a flavour there and I can't... Mm -hmm. My nostril on it. This one has a golden syrupy. Golden syrup. It's definitely yep. golden syrup. That's lovely. Ooh. It's got a velvety smell to it as well. If you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. if you know that's a, a velvety. Yeah. Should we try it? Yes, I'm so Fine. excited. Oh. Another another bottling. <laughs> what strength is this one? Fifty five points on. Mm, do you feel that, it? Oh, oh no, I, I think I feel the strength. I think that's like I burnt really my tea yesterday. Oh, though, so did you? Of... That's annoying. <laughs> I feel that's creamy, mm, and then I get the, the the strength really thing, malty, but, and, the, and then there's a spice. Yes, uh, I get actually smell. Uh, a spice. <laughs> a spice on the smell. <laughs> <laughs> a spice on the spell. A spice on the spell. A spice on the smell. Oh, it's really. It's. I'm trying mm. to find a way to describe it. It feels very homely. Mm. We've gone from holidays to home. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's malty and creamy. Really mm -hmm. creamy. Oh, I actually love that. We got a message from 
so we've got four of us that have the calendar shop and we've got a message from two of the boys when there's been an awful, there's been a, there's been an actual tragedy, a total mistake. Like, and, and I saw it and I was like, ah, oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> we just messaged back all these laughing faces and they were like, so you don't want it changed then? And we were like, no, no it's perfectly fine. <laughs> we exactly want it want. misspelled. Um, should we add some water Let's to this? Water. And I can check yeah. the taste notes while I'm doing that. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, flavours for this one. Grassy, lemon sponge, caramel, vanilla, stewed apples. Definitely got mm. grassy freshness mm -hmm. on the palate. Sandy on the freshness. Sandy freshness. On the snows. <laughs> on the snows. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you said? No, I thought I said palate. Did I say snows? You said snows. Sandy freshness, sandy freshness, sandy freshness. And then generous sherry, maple syrup, espresso coffee, cinnamon, mm. spice and hazelnut. Oh, hazelnut, yes. Definitely get a hazelnut. Oh, that's lovely. It's like a sweetness that kind of goes... Mm -hmm. And then away. Mm -hmm. like, like the shore. Yeah, like the, the water on the like shore. Like the pebbles. Mm -hmm. No, like the, the sand. water. Yes. Sand. <laughs> what were you saying? Tiny pebbles. <laughs> Tiny, tiny pebbles. Tiny, <laughs> delicious pebbles. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I love it. That's really tasty. So, calendar, calendar drinks, company bottling. Mm. You should get some. We've mm -hmm. got some. I'm going to so get some. I'm going to get some. I feel like we've got to those. Oh, so we do. We do. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for joining us. Yeah. Um, See you yeah. next time. Yeah. Cheers. Bye. Thanks for joining us, we hope you enjoyed our video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. You can catch us on social media as well, at The Grail Tastings. Slange, and see you next time. Right, I just jumped in with just... I'm Jen! No, no, you're right, because usually you oh, say I'm Jen, and I say I'm Rachel. And I'm just waiting for you to be like, right, you're fine. I'm Jen, I like beer. I like jam. I <laughs>